there's this uh, female uh, cosplayer, um, and you can look her up on her Facebook page. Um, I hope it's okay that I say this. Well, it's a public page, so she should be okay with it. Um, it's a princess mentality cosplay. And I don't know if she goes by that full title, or if it's just princess mentality, or if she goes by her actual name, which I'm not going to tell you, because frankly that shit ain't cool. Um, but uh, there was, um, like I said, she's a female um, cosplayer, and she also happens to be black. So it's Black History Month, and that's why I'm kind of paying that this, I have to report this story during Black History Month. But I guess uh, a particular photo of her, um, of a character that, um, by Sailor Moon, which is an anime character. So this, oh, this picture here. That is awesome. Which is um, absolutely adorable. That is just way cool. Um, and if you've ever seen um, the character Sailor Moon, that is an awesome costume. Oh, yeah. Really? And uh, representation um, of it. So. Yeah, that's like, that's perfect. Yeah. Uh, and she's got a lot of um, other costumes, which I'll, I'll show you a little later on. But once this, uh, I don't know if it was this particular photo, um, there was a, a, several photos taken of her in this costume, but this is the, um, the one that I saw originally. And I guess after it started to you know, make the rounds through like you know, um, 4chan and Tumblr and all these various websites, all these n really like negative comments um, started surfacing. Um, some of them just like downright racist, other than others like Ooh. borderline racist. Ooh, that's like, so good. like the kind of racism you get when like you know you're a white person but you're too stupid to know that you're actually still racist. <laughs> um, so uh, she's been getting a lot of flag and a lot of people are making the suggestion and this is this is so goddamn ridiculous. People are making the suggestion that people should not cosplay outside of their race. Oh, that is fucked and up. Like, like, there's no fucking separatism no, in cosplay because there's all. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna show you any of them. Sorry, you can look them up on your own. <laughs> Anyone can if you have Google. You know how to use it. Yep. Um, but there are all sorts of people who dress up as different anime characters, and I hate to, you know, ruin it for you, but that shit is Japanese. And unless you're a Japanese girl, maybe you shouldn't be dressing up like it either. But it's just I can't do it. It's just ridiculous to think that you have to be like the shade or the color of the character that you're portraying. Oh, you, she makes a fantastic you, Sailor Moon. You you mm. don't. It just you know it's all about you know having fun and who has like a cooler costume. Schedule yeah. really doesn't, I think, come into play in it. And no, it shouldn't. I mean, it's it's oh. just it's it's expressing yourself and yeah. it's just being fun. Go and ahead and, uh, and show the, uh, the the other uh, photos. There's her as a uh, Catwoman. Nice. I'm, I'm kind of wondering, like, where she picked up the motorcycle. Like, if she was just, like, at, like, one of the comic book conventions. She's like, hey, can I take a picture on your motorcycle? Um, and then, oh, God, uh, that's... I can't remember the name of this character, though. But um, that's an awesome costume. The fact that she made the chainsaw is really cool. That is sweet. Um, now, in this picture, it's kind yeah. of cool because there are actually other black people in this photo. She's obviously uh, centered there. Uh, there's uh, a lot of pictures of her in this costume um, that I found on the internet, but this one I really like just because it really shows off the costume yeah, no itself kidding. and the cape really well. Um, and she looks amazing in it. Oh, she hell yeah, she does. Her, as she does in most of her photos. Aww. But, you know, she takes this really seriously. She's been doing it for years. And just the nerve of somebody to say that you, you know, you shouldn't. Oh, that is hot. That, you know, you shouldn't, you know, be able to wear a costume outside of your race. I mean, it, it just, it ruins the whole fucking point yeah. of cosplay. Oh, cosplay. Dressing up like something that you're not. Because mm -hmm. she's clearly not Captain America, because Captain America is a fucking man. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. But there are a shit ton of pictures of women, you know, on the internet, yeah. dressing up as characters that are, you know, that are known as being men. I don't know that there's a whole lot of cosplay where dudes are dressing up as, you know, as women. But Quite a bit. Could be. If that becomes a thing, then so fucking be it. Like, yeah. race, skin tone, gender, it doesn't fucking matter. The only thing that matters in cosplay is, like, I think this character is bitching, and I want to emulate it and dress like them and go to a fucking convention and have fun. That's what it's about. And if your costume's awesome, then you're fucking awesome. And those are the rules, the oh, only yes. rules. So, um, right. but yeah, it was just... 
kind of a fucked up story to run across, you know, in like Black History Month, and I, you know, would like to talk about something like, you know, really like truly inspirational, but just like that was just really troubling um, me. to me. Yeah. So, like I said, uh, her name is um, uh, on Facebook is Princess um, Mentality Cosplay, um, and. And she has really awesome. Yeah, she has she has a lot uh, more photos yeah. up than than I, than I showed. I just showed a, a few of the ones that I thought were particularly iconically awesome. Mm -hmm. So, and I also tweeted her a link to this stream. I don't know if she watched it or not, but hopefully she did, and hopefully she doesn't hate me now. 